Hi, I'm Will Wayne Williams, a journalist from PKN Packaging News. I'm here on the JR Leonard stand with Glenn from JR Leonard and David from Silverson Machines. Glenn, could you tell us a little bit about the partnership that you guys have got going? Uh, the partnership has been ongoing for over five decades uh, with Silverson Mixing Machines, the premier mixing technology in the world. Uh, we're very excited to have David out here after the COVID epidemic and look forward to our ongoing relationship. Hey, thank you. And David, could you tell us a little bit about what you've got on the stand here? Yeah, certainly. Well, Silverson Machines are the premier maker of rotor stator mixers. That's where you have a rotor revolving inside a static mesh. Now, we're involved in just about every industry you can imagine, mixing food, pharmaceuticals, chemicals, petrochemicals. This is a very small selection of machines. We mix volumes from around five mils up to about 60 tonnes and a broad spectrum. So anything you can imagine that you can mix, where you're doing liquid-liquid, you're doing powders or solids into liquids, we can mix them. And it's a very simple machine, and it's, it's a broad spectrum across a wide range of um, applications that other machines find it very difficult to do. So from our point of view, it's a very, very universal machine, and its applications are on hold. And who's the target market for these? Who are you well, aiming them at? In this exhibition, it would be food, beverage, and personal care. And in personal care, that's one of our biggest industries, so you'd be looking at any body lotions, creams, hair conditioners, shampoos, that sort of equipment. Could you explain a few of the main features of these machines that you've got here? Well, you've got two different types of machines here. On the one hand, you've got the rotor stator batch mixer. That would be dropped into a tank, and it's for doing relatively low volumes, up to about 1,000 litres. Once you go above that, you tend to go looking at the inline mixers. Now, these can be attached to a tank of any size, and you would recirculate the product through that. So we've got two essentially different approaches, but they're both using a rotor stator system. And a question for either of you. What are you guys hoping to get out of exhibiting here at Apex? Well, I'll step in here. Um, what we're really hoping is with David's expertise and knowledge that we'd like people who are having trouble with their mixing applications to come in and talk to him and have a chat and see what we can do to solve their problems. Because I'm sure that you will be very, very surprised. Okay, well, thank you so much to the both of you for okay. taking the time to talk to us and wish you a success here at Apex. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.